Before we get started in today's video, if you are new watching this and if you're looking for all the best Wrexham AFC content on the YouTube platform, then make sure to get down there, click the subscribe button. I'm bringing you all the latest news regarding Wrexham, the signing news, match day vlogs, just general news on the club. It is covered here on the channel, so you do not want to miss any of that. So make sure to get down there and click the subscribe button as we close in on that magical 20,000 subscribers. And let's get talking about Will Boyle, joining the Reds. After weeks of speculation and after weeks of multiple transfer videos and multiple videos saying about signings we could potentially make at Wrexham, it has been confirmed we have made our first summer signing of the 23-24 Sky Bet League 2 season. So it has been confirmed at 9 o'clock this evening that Will Boyle, the centre-back, has made the move from Championship side Huddersfield Town over to Wrexham as we go back into our first season in the EFL. So this is a bit of news that sort of come out of the blue the last couple of hours. Obviously there was rumours going around that Will Boyle was one of the players that was potentially signing for Wrexham FC and since those rumours have been swirling around Twitter, like I said, Wrexham have announced that this evening that he has signed on a three year deal, a 27 year old obviously formerly of Cheltenham Town where he did play an instrumental part in their promotion to League One. Obviously, if you don't know already, he did play a huge role alongside Ben Tozer when they did get promoted from League Two to League One. Both of Tozer and Will Boyle did get in that team of the season that year. So it's clear to see they formed a good partnership and hopefully they can bring that partnership that they had at Cheltenham over to Wrexham and get us promoted. So before anything, I only feel like it's right to give you sort of a profile on Will Boyle. Now Will Boyle is a 27 year old defender who we have signed from championship side Huddersfield Town where he made 16 appearances this season for the Terriers. Obviously he was brought into that Huddersfield side due to a number of injuries so Huddersfield fans are saying he played more than he should have done but yeah, I mean, he's a good player, he's a good sign, and he's proven at our level, and he's obviously done something to impress the manager of Huddersfield Town at the time when they did sign him, playing 16 games in the Championship. The most important one of those games being when he started against Sheffield United when they did win 1-0, which was obviously a huge result, and he was part of that back line that did keep a clean sheet. So it's clear to see he's a defender of many qualities, and most importantly, you might have heard me say it multiple times on the channel that Phil Parkinson is after a left-footed centre-back and that is exactly what Will Boyle is. So we're most likely going to see Will Boyle sit into that left centre-back role coming into this season. Obviously, like I said, we needed a left centre-back. I'm 99.9% .9 sure all of our defenders at the minute are right-footed, so it's great to have that new option of that left-footed centre-back, obviously, to accompany Jacob Mendy down that left-hand side. Will Boyle is also a player who started his career off at Huddersfield Town many years ago in the academy before breaking through into the first team where he also has spent time on loan at the likes of Kidderminster Harriers, Macclesfield Town, York City and Kilmarnock up in Scotland before obviously his move to Cheltenham Town where he did make over 200 appearances and obviously he did achieve that promotion to League One. So he carries a vast amount of experience in the EFL, just what we need ahead of our first season back in League Two and it's great to have obviously Tozer who's been promoted from League Two to League One not too long ago and then obviously to have his centre-back partnership in Will Boyle's also sign is absolutely incredible news. It's clear to see we are starting to assemble an incredible squad. On signing for Wrexham, this is the words that Will Boyle has said in his interview. He said, I'm delighted the deal's over the line and I'm looking forward to getting started. It's a great time to join. I can't say anything that people don't already know about what's happening at this football club, but it's also a perfect time for me to join, I feel, and a perfect opportunity for me. So it's clear to see Will Boyle is happy to be at the club. Obviously, he will be linked up with his teammates ahead of the US tour so to everyone saying oh we're going to go to the US without any signings I'm 99.9% .9 sure that Will Boyle will be in the squad ahead of that tour to the USA and like I said it's our first signing of the 23-24 season and if I'm being brutally honest, I was definitely expecting it to be a centre-back, or if not a defender. I'd say adding a defender was definitely our main priority this summer. Definitely adding a left-footed centre-back, which, I mean, Will Boyle, is he the best that we possibly could have got? I would say he's definitely up there because obviously 18 appearances in the championship last year for Huddersfield Town. He's coming fresh off the back of a, we'd say, half a season in the championship. He's gained experience there playing against some of the best teams in the league, like I pointed out as well. He played a big part in that 1-0 win over Sheffield United, so he's an experienced defender and 
this is an incredible signing. And a word from his former manager at Huddersfield, Neil Warnock, he did say, Will is a fantastic boy and an academy graduate and has been fantastic around the building since my return to the club. Wanting to increase his playing time, Boyley has a fantastic opportunity with Wrexham and I wish him all the best with his new side. So Neil Warnock speaks very highly of him, which obviously is a good thing, Neil Warnock, what manager he is. So like I said, all round, what a signing this is. All I can say in brief is that he's going to slot into that left centre-back role really well, who we can imagine will be alongside either Hayden, Tozer, Tony Cliff, O'Connell. We don't know, the list of our defenders goes on, but it will be interesting because Parkey is going to have a massive headache when it does come down to selecting our back three centre-backs for the upcoming season. If I'm being honest, I think Will Boyle will definitely cement himself in that left centre-back role. Obviously, we didn't do too bad last year with a right-footed defender on that left-hand side. Obviously, it wasn't noticeable at all, but for comfortability, I think Will Boyle is definitely going to be our number one option in that left centre-back role. And of course, Will Boyle will have come for a transfer fee unless that Huddersfield decided to terminate his contract in order for us to sign him, but I doubt that is the case because I believe Huddersfield will have paid a transfer fee from Cheltenham Town not too long ago for the centre-back. So, yeah, if we're looking at a transfer fee and if he wasn't really in Huddersfield's plans for the upcoming season, I can't imagine that they will have demanded stupid amounts of money like some clubs would have done. I feel like they'd have been respectable about it. I'm probably looking towards the six-figure digit fee, but... Like I said, they might have done something with his contract. They might have terminated it in order for him to come to Wrexham, but I highly doubt that is the case. So I'm assuming probably minimum £100,000. It says it on the T-shirt, welcome to Wrexham, Will Boyle. He's officially here. We've made our first summer signing and it couldn't have got any better than we thought. Let's hope that we announce maybe, maybe one before our US trip. I think that's definitely a push, but as long as Parkinson feels like he's got the right man in, he's taken his time, we can finally relax now that we've got summer signing in through the door in Will Boyle. And yeah, exciting times at Wrexham and it's an exciting signing. A vast amount of experience in the EFL, just what we needed. And as well, keep an eye out. It has come today. I have received the new Wrexham 23-24 home shirt. Still brand new in the back. It came this morning, so I was really tempted to open that. But you will see a video of me unboxing the home shirt, maybe intertwined with the stadium tour that is coming next Wednesday. So, I mean, that is not one you want to miss. And the new black shirt has been ordered today. I mean, they have sold out incredibly well. I think medium and large for the away shirt sold out likewise with the third shirt. So, I mean, they are going down a hit amongst rex and fc fans so you will see an unboxing for that home shirt soon and hopefully if the third shirt does come relatively soon then maybe we could open that with the home shirt that'd be incredible but yeah will boyle is a Wrexham player and will boyle will be playing in a Wrexham shirt next season in league two what a signing this is let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below like i said he's gonna be playing in the back line alongside toza most likely as they have had that success previously with Cheltenham town he's a left-footed center back he's 27 he's in the prime of his career he's just what we needed so yeah if you are new to the channel make sure to click that red subscribe button like i said i bring you all the fastest and latest up-to-date wrexham afc news whether it be transfer news match day vlogs or news in general on the club it is here on this channel so make sure to get down there and click the notification bell on so you're notified every time this news is released on the channel and yeah that is it from me finally we've got a sign in in through the door pen to paper will boil is a red hope you have a good rest of your evening i was not expecting this i'd heard the rumors lingering around on twitter but i didn't expect it to be announced at nine o'clock today so it's been a quick one and i hope you enjoyed and i'll see you in the next one up the town. Will here, buzzing to be signing for Wrexham. Can't wait to get going. Up the town.